In today's video, I'm sharing with you a spring free people haul that has accessories as well as different denim, pants, dresses, skirts, so many different items that I think you'll absolutely love adding to your spring summer wardrobe. Free People was definitely made for spring and summer. It's the epitome of that beautiful boho chic vibes. The first thing we'll start with is this beautiful lace detailed bodysuit that is very airy and gorgeous, very versatile. You can wear it with denim, a maxi skirt, so many different items. It really gives a nod to the Bridgerton trend of that beautiful kind of antique -y look, but it's not so over the top that next year you'll be wondering like, what was I wearing? You know how sometimes you really get excited about something and then you get it because it's very, very trendy. And then you look back and you're like, wow, this was bad. <laughs> this was very bad. It's got the puff sleeves, which statement sleeves are a big trend for 2022. And the detail is just so gorgeous. They also have the bodysuit in a rust color as well. I just chose the white because I wanted it to kind of go with everything. This has been a staple and I've already gotten the ROI from it. The other thing that I want to show you is the choker that I'm wearing it with, which is a beautiful Western inspired choker that is an absolute statement. And I think that this goes with so many different things. If you've been wanting to try the Western trend and are ready to buy Western boots or anything super fringy. This is just a great way to kind of test the waters, have that cowgirl vibe, but not be over the top. If you're interested in learning more ways on how to style the Western trend, make sure to check out my video and where I really dedicate like how to wear cowboy boots and fringe and all of that good stuff. Kind of along those lines is this awesome hat. When I was at Free People, I put all of these items on Instagram just to kind of get a read for what people are loving and not liking. When I put this hat up, I had nearly 100% like, yes, it's gorgeous, it's perfect. And <laughs> my husband calls it Indiana Jones hat. I think he's just jealous, but they have it in a couple of different hues. It's very functional. When it's sunnier, of course, we need a little bit more shade. So I think it could go many different ways, either at the beach or at the pool, at a festival. Cute. So anytime that you have an outfit where you would normally wear a baseball hat, test this out, see if this works for you. And it's beautifully made. It's soft and it's not too heavy on my head. I've been wearing a lot more hats over the last year. And that's something I really look for is if the hat already feels heavy, like when I put it on and I'm very aware of it, then it's like a no-go for me. And I always find that I wear hats the most when they are functional and they are light. It's a little bit pricier at $88, but it is well-made. The next thing I want to show you is this really beautiful, subtle floral dress that comes in a couple of different prints as well. I got this one because the bottom just kind of fades in really well. It's, it's an asymmetrical hemline, so it's definitely a little bit longer in the back, which I really love. I feel like it kind of looks like you are kind of floating in the wind. It does come with a liner slip. So if you are at the beach and, or at the pool and want to use this more as like a cover up, you can skip the slip, but it does come with a slip in case you want that protection, right? And what inspired me getting this dress was that I pictured wearing it with the harness belt that I also got from Free People a month ago or so because I just love this flowy silhouette but then kind of wrapping it all and tying it in together with that harness belt just felt super modern and very relevant right now speaking of the harness belt here it is I really love it they have it in many many different colors I heard from my community on Instagram that they have gotten it in different colors as well and they absolutely love it I have a video dedicated on how to style this trend, as well as a couple of other like really viral TikTok trends in case you wanna check it out. There's one shirt that I have worn over and over again. It's this little queen pullover. They have a few different colors and I wear it to sleep, I wear it to travel in. Like I've worn it with this belt as well um, for fashion week. So it's very, very versatile. It always makes a statement. I always get compliments on it. It's indestructible. I've washed it a hundred different times. It is also a great gift for that powerful woman in your life. Um, maybe even like Mother's Day or something like that. So I really recommend this shirt. I'm so glad that they keep restocking it because it is such a winner. Next up, we have this gorgeous jumpsuit. And this one comes in a couple of different patterns as well. More of like a strawberry and red color. I'm about 5'5", five five, and this jumpsuit with me in sneakers hits like right at the ground. It's really sexy. It's very slinky. I wore this recently with a belt like uh, it's from Mage. It's like another kind of Western belt that has like the double buckle. It was super cute. I did style this with platforms, which I love because it, it kind of gave me this whole 70s vibe. And 
I really, really liked it and so did my husband. He doesn't come in a whole lot on my outfits. He's so desensitized. But every now and again, I will hear, oh wow, that's a really, that's a really awesome outfit. So winner for him. Oh my gosh, the weather here is just ridiculous. It's hilarious. It's, you just gotta laugh at some point. But I wanna share three different denim picks from Free People that I really like. They're very popular, they're bestsellers. Number one are these Levi shorts that are the cutoff shorts. They're probably the shortest shorts that I've ever worn that I have felt good in. I've just never liked the way that shorts fit me. There's always something wrong with them, like my waist and my hip. There's something about that whole area that just goes all off for me in shorts. I wear these all the time, I love them. They are also bestsellers. In terms of denim pants, one pair of denim pants that I really love are the super wide extra kind of Western pants that are just very, very big. They look, they feel kind of like a skirt. They have these beautiful pleats and kind of gathering on the sides that just add a lot to like the way that they sit on your hips. They are gorgeous. And if you want to take your denim to the next level, like the whole like skinny jeans and high-waisted fight thing that's going on right now. And you know, at the end of the day, unless you're using a crop top, like it's hard to tell exactly what kind of denim you're wearing in my opinion, but something like this very much makes a statement and it's not, it's not everywhere yet. So I really love them. I wore them a lot at Paris Fashion Week and I felt super chic in them. The other pair that I really like that is so comfortable that feels like leggings is the wide legged kind of like denim flare pants. They have them in a hundred different colors, 10 different colors <laughs> there and they, are just so comfortable. They do tend to run pretty long. So unless you want to commit to platforms, if you're a little short like me, I would definitely offer the petite size. A little intermission. I'll show you my latest spring bag real quick that I literally just got yesterday in the mail. I ordered it from Fashion File, which they do like the designer handbags usually for less, just depends on the condition they're in and how popular they are, etc. This is the Gucci Diana bamboo bag. Like most people, I have a lot of black bags. I don't have anything, any designer lighter bags. So this wasn't really on my radar. I just happened to see it like as I was looking for something else. And I thought how classic, like it's got a strap as well. It's got like a little bit of a ladylike handle. It's beautiful. I have no idea why the handles need like a little seat belt. I'm gonna do more research on it. And then I'll get back to you on a full review on it after I've worn it a couple of times. Recommend Fashion File. I, I never shopped from them before. My sister-in-law swears by it. This bag was like in the new condition and I agree. It looks like it's never been worn. I think it's kind of like buying a car a little bit. Like the minute you drive it off the lot, wore it once, it's over. You know, it's been, it's worth a little bit less. Just wanted to share it with you. I'll be styling it a lot more this spring, summer. Now this next piece, um, I'm really curious about. I picked it up because I love, love this plaid print. And I don't know if you can tell here, but it's kind of like a gauzy material that I think is just kind of reminds me of like, I looked at this and I'm like, oh, this looks like I'm spending like the summer in Tuscany or something. Like, it's just so romantic. It's so easy to wear. It's dressy and feminine, but yet it's not like uptight. Like, oh, I'm dressed up and I'm, you know, um, it might look really cute with this bodysuit actually. Um, but this piece is, can also be a dress. Gravitated towards it, just having more versatility in one piece was amazing. I got an extra small, but it sits really pretty like on your hips. I love the way it looks. And then, you know, for the beach, it's just a good beach cover up that you don't have to think about too hard. Um, and then, you know, maybe grab a different top and take it to dinner if you're like on a beach vacation or something like that. Really gorgeous piece. But the piece that I'm it's not doing it for me is this ruche top. And I love anything that's ruched. I just remember my mom wearing a lot of it when I was growing up. And so I think I have that emotional connection to it. It fits well. I think it's cute. I think that I'm just a little over like animal print. I think. I'm always really into it in the fall, just like everybody else. And I think I'm just ready to not have animal print in my life for, you know, a few months. The reason I did pick it up, there was also a couple of different, very floral, beautiful paisley type of prints as well. The reason I did pick it up is because I think we tend to like pick colors that we know we look good in. And I feel like brown is a good color for me. So I just was like, oh, I love animal print and brown usually looks good on me. And so I picked it up and then the ruching kind of put me over the top emotionally. It's a really, really cool shirt. I might give a different pattern a try because it's just a great spring top, great over a bathing suit or 
just an easy casual shirt that you can dress up with like something like this or a hat or something like that. It is $68. Thanks so much for watching. Make sure to subscribe if you want to see more fashion and styling videos. I also publish a styling video every day on my shorts playlist in case you need styling ideas that are really, really timely and seasonal. I hope to see you really soon and have a great day.